What is up guys? It is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling and today we are doing the WWE 2021 Elimination Chamber pay-per-view predictions. There's not many matches on this card and I just want to say that this is being recorded before the Go Home Smackdown so anything new that isn't in the video I will update in the description down below. Without further ado, let's get right into the predictions. Okay, everyone, so kicking things off, we have a match that I am quite looking forward to. The United States Championship Triple Threat Match. Bobby Lashley versus Keith Lee versus Riddle. Now, this isn't the initial um, treatment I wanted to see Keith Lee have. I actually wanted to see Keith Lee in the chamber and win the chamber. Um, but, you know, that's obviously not going to happen. Um, so, that's some potential video idea, maybe. What about, guys, how would you feel... Keith Lee, uh, fantasy booking world title run. We'll see. But anyways, Riddle, Lashley, Keith Lee. There's not much to this one. Um, I think Bobby Lashley has been doing fantastic things with the United States Championship. And I believe he, you know, he's earned that spot at WrestleMania to be champion. So whether they redo this match, whether they do a ladder match at Mania, I'm not too sure. However, I think that until WrestleMania, Bobby Lashley will retain the United States Championship. Next up on the card, we have the Raw Women's Championship match. The champion, Oscar defending against Lacey Evans. Now, Lacey Evans is pregnant, um, <laughs> which I believe is real. If you want to check out my reaction to that, happened last week on Raw, you can check it out. Um, so, Lacey Evans is actually pregnant, and that means she can't compete, meaning we've got a to-be-determined opponent for Asuka. Now, this could be someone completely random. Firstly, I just want to say my prediction, whoever it is, Asuka to retain, um, but I believe it's most likely going to be like Peyton Royce because she's Lacey's partner. Um, failing that, maybe give us someone completely random like um, Dana Brooke. Uh, I don't know, but Asuka to win whoever it's against. Okay, so next up we have the SmackDown Elimination Chamber match. Now, typically, if the Royal Rumble winner hasn't decided on a champion to face yet at WrestleMania, uh, traditionally... Both champions have to defend in the chamber, and I'm quite disappointed because this year I was really looking forward to seeing Reigns defend in the chamber. Uh, but no, Paul Heyman has managed to uh, wiggle his way out of it this year for Reigns, and uh, now he will defend immediately after. So we've got the chamber match. Whoever wins will face Reigns immediately after for the Universal Championship. The participants in the chamber match are as follows. Daniel Bryan, Cesaro, Kevin Owens, Jey Uso, King Corbin, and Sami Zayn. Now, uh, I don't know what's going to go on here. I've seen people say Kevin Owens wins, um, but I don't think that's going to happen. My pick is either Daniel Bryan, which is the one I think is going to happen, but the one I'd like to happen is Cesaro. I would love to see Cesaro just get that push uh, into the main event for a bit um, and, yeah, take on Roman Reigns. However, my actual prediction is for Daniel Bryan to win the Elimination Chamber and face Reigns immediately after. That means next up, Roman Reigns defends the Universal Championship against the winner of the Elimination Chamber. Now, whether the winner is Brian, Kevin, Cesaro, Uso, Corbin, or Zayn, the result will be the same. The Tribal Chief will raise up the Universal Championship and retain the title. Do you honestly think Reigns is dropping the championship before WrestleMania? No chance in hell. We know it's most likely gonna be, unless plans change, Edge versus Reigns at WrestleMania. So Roman Reigns, whoever wins the chamber, uh, my pick, Daniel Bryan, Reigns will beat them probably in a matter of like four minutes because uh, they've just been in an elimination chamber match. There is no way they will win against Roman Reigns, not after being in the chamber. It's, it's ludicrous. But yeah, that's the Universal Championship match. Let's move on to what I think is going to be the main event. Okay, it is time for the main event of the evening, the Men's Elimination Chamber match. All former WWE champions, WWE Championship on the line. This is the Raw Men's Chamber match. Drew McIntyre defends against The Miz, not anymore, Kofi Kingston, Sheamus, Randy Orton, AJ Styles and Jeff 
Hardy. The WWE title is on the line. Sheamus will be entering last. And my logic behind this, I've got two predictions. So I know I'm normally only allowed one, but I'm going to give two. One, option one. Drew McIntyre to retain. I don't know what that means for Drew. If he retains, who does he face at Mania? He would have beaten everyone. Maybe Keith Lee. I'd love that. Um, but the one that I think is actually going to happen. Option two. Sheamus comes in at number six and wins the WWE Championship from Drew McIntyre. The reason they do this is because they've been building this Sheamus-Drew feud for a while now. McIntyre versus Sheamus at WrestleMania in front of a partial crowd. Drew can get a WrestleMania moment in beating Sheamus in front of the crowd. Once again, three-time WWE Champion Drew McIntyre. Now, the reason I think they're going to do this is because if Drew wins, there's no one he hasn't beaten already on Raw. There is literally no one. He has beaten everyone. So that's my main prediction. Now, for things that are going to happen in the match, uh, I think it might come down to Drew, Sheamus and Kofi. I think they're really going to try and push the whole, you know, Kofi, can, can he do it once again? Uh, but obviously he won't. And then... Uh, I think The Fiend is going to get involved. And not just The Fiend. I think we're going to get a burned, charcoal-like Fiend with a, a either a new mask or a heavily burned mask uh, that's going to look really creepy. I think he's going to get involved and attack Randy Orton or take his spot uh, or do something. Uh, so I've got The Fiend coming out, Kofi lasting pretty much until the end, and Sheamus winning. My main prediction is for Sheamus to win i know it's out there but let's see if i'm right anyways guys i hope you enjoyed the video if you did please be sure to give it a like comment and subscribe i've been joe from joe talks wrestling you guys have been awesome elimination chamber reactions will be up live on sunday uh, so i hope to see you then goodbye